Hello everybody, I'm Richard Holdner. Welcome to another episode of Speed Secrets. This episode is brought to you by the guys at Comp Cans. Now today we're going to look at two different things. First of all, choosing the right camshaft for a small block stroker 4. Then once we get that baby up and running, we're going to hit it with a little nitrous. To get things started, we need to choose a camshaft for a 347 inch stroker 4. So what makes a stroker cam different? Well, there are two things. First of all, it's just displacement. Displacement tends to tame cam timing, meaning we can run wilder cam timing on a stroker application. The next thing is the increase in stroke length accelerates the piston away from top dead center much quicker. For optimum use, this requires revised cam timing. So what does all this mean? Well, for us, it meant we needed a camshaft designed specifically for a small block forward stroker application. Lucky for us, Comp Cams had just that. Now we selected the smaller of the two cams, the XFI 236HR14, but Comp also offers a larger grind for 392, 408, and 427 strokers. So what are we waiting for? Let's get that baby up on the dyno and let's make some noise. A powerful Comp XFI camshaft in our 347 with ported heads. Then up on the dyno to test the power. Looks like we chose the right cam. Okay guys, it looks like that XFI stroker cam was working out pretty well. I mean our 347 inch motor was making almost 450 horsepower. But it got us thinking. You know what's even better than a 347 that makes 450 horsepower? One that makes 600. To bridge that gap, we installed some Zex. Time for the Zex kit. We installed the perimeter plate with 12 individual injection points and adjustable jetting. The kit featured high flow solenoids. For the test, we dialed in the fuel pressure and the nitrous pressure. Over 600 horsepower with the 150 shot. Okay guys, the results are in and as you can see, that Zex kit came through once again. I mean, it increased the power output of our 347 stroker forward from 441 horsepower and 406 foot-pounds to 612 horsepower and 574 foot-pounds of torque. I mean, those are some serious gains and it's just so easy with nitrous. So if you're looking for a solid stroker combination, choose the right cam and hit it with some Zex. I'm Richard Holder. That's all the time I have. I want to thank the guys at Comp Cams and the guys at Zex Join me next time on Speed Secrets.